One of the things that responsible pet owners want to know is what is in my dog food? And that is, that's something, number one, we believe they deserve to know. A lot of emphasis is put on what the number one ingredient on a list is and what the number two ingredient on a list is. And rightfully so, people would like to know what the main thing in the dog food is. Many companies talk about, oh, we use just chicken, or we use pure beef, or we use lamb, or we use turkey. And we don't use turkey meal. We don't use chicken meal. We use chicken. And this is very, very important uh, about what really is in dog food. When you see the word chicken, and it doesn't say meal after it or something else in a dog food, that means that they're using a product that is coming from a chicken processing factory that is primarily water. And in fact, it has about 60 to 75 percent water in it. That's why it is used in such a high amount in the food. And that's why it's the number one ingredient. For instance, chicken it has all this water in it, which is the natural way. If you look at a chicken in the store in the bag and you buy a fryer to go home and cook, that natural moisture content of that bird is about 60 to 70 percent. Just like you, your body or mine, we are mostly water. And so by far the most weight in that word chicken is water. It doesn't contribute any protein. It doesn't contribute any other real chicken solid flesh. And another thing that's a little bit disturbing when you really get down to it, the pet food companies that use chicken, etc., as the first ingredient, they'll show you a picture of a nice roasted smoking chicken in their commercial or in their magazine advertising. And they really give you a good feeling, don't they? The truth is what that chicken looks like at the pet food plant that's being put in the product is a whole lot like this. And I tell you what, it doesn't look much like a nice roasted smoking chicken, does it? This is very accurate, what this looks like, versus what you're being shown on the advertising. The amount of protein in this chicken with that much moisture in it is about 15%. And that's in the National Research Council book, by the way. This isn't made up. That is the known level of protein in something that has that much moisture in it. Conversely, if you take chicken meal, which is chicken flesh, no organ meat, dried down, cooked into a dry form that only has about 5 or 6% moisture in it, the protein content of it runs from about 58 to about 65 percent. That is a huge difference in the amount of protein being contributed by chicken meal than the word chicken. So if you're trying to have a 22 percent or a 26 percent protein dog food and your number one ingredient is chicken, this, and this is 15 percent protein, well how are you getting to 22? Well, you're getting to 22 with one of the other ingredients down the list of other ways that doesn't have all the water in it, like corn and gluten meal or some other vegetable protein sources. You're not getting most of your protein from what you really wanted, which was an animal source in many cases. Don't be fooled by people that are just simply trying to make you believe something's real when it's not. You need to find a company you can depend on. It's not trying to pull the wool over your eyes. It's trying to tell you the truth, that wants to be honest, trying their desperate, desperately hardest to make you the best pet food you can buy. That's the way company was founded. That's the way it's produced. That's how it's regulated and monitored on an ongoing basis. And folks, this is a little bit more than I can stand to think. You're seeing the picture of the smoking roasted chicken, and this is the reality. Uh, hope you understand our point. Thank you.